All right, what's up, guys? So today I figured I'd show you guys how to drive a stick shift because as a first video, I didn't have any ideas at all. And I figured this would be kind of a good one considering that I do want to do mainly car stuff and also music stuff on the channel. So with that being said, let's get started. So the first thing you're going to want to get familiar with is the three pedal layout. So you have your clutch, your brake, and your gas, and also your dead pedal on the left. This is in every car. This is your clutch. This is your brake, and this is your gas. I almost dropped my camera. I'm so sorry. Now, the main difference in like uh, manual cars versus automatic is obviously the third pedal and that this uh, shifter in the middle, you don't have the, you know, basic P, R, N, D, L or whatever it is. You have this layout here, which looks like an H. It's for one, two, three, four, five, six. And the R on the right, the R stands for reversed and these numbers are for years. Oof. All right. So first things first. I'm going to teach you how to actually start the car. So what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to go ahead and push the clutch in all the way. And then you're going to want to grab your key or in this case, it's a push to start. You just start the car. Oh yeah, that's right. This isn't actually my car. Once your car is all started and everything, you can take your foot off the clutch and you can let it warm up for a minute. And then once it's warmed up uh, to go ahead and actually start driving it, you're going to go ahead and Push your foot into the clutch all the way. You're gonna push the clutch down all the way, I'm sorry. And then you're gonna go come over here. You're gonna grab your shifter and you're gonna push it over to the first gear, just like that. And then you're gonna slowly come off of it until the car starts to move on its own, in which that case, you'll go on the gas and give it gas. And there you go, just like that. Now you're now you're rolling and driving. You're driving in first gear. So the moment that you hear the car kind of just spool up and start revving really, really high, typically around like two, 3,000 RPMs I like to shift, you're gonna go ahead and push it in. And then you're just gonna right into second, come off very slowly, give it gas, and there you go, just like that. And that's how it's gonna be for every single shift. You're gonna go ahead, push the clutch in, third, off the clutch, on the gas, boom. One more time, clutch in, off the gas, fourth, boom, there you go. When you do it, it's gonna be a lot faster. You're gonna want, you're gonna wanna go ahead and push the clutch in and then shift at the same time. And then just like that, you're driving a stick shift. But now you have to learn to downshift. And downshifting while rev, mat or rev matching while downshifting is also kind of a task, but it's still pretty easy more or less. All you do is, like I said, you just go ahead and push the clutch in, downshift to wherever you wanna go, and then you let go, and that's how you downshift. Now rev matching is you go ahead, you downshift, but before you let before you let go of the clutch, you want to flip the throttle so that it, the um, RPMs can shoot back up to where they need to go. And then when they're coming back down from where they are, you want to let go of the clutch slowly, and then get back on the gas or the brake or whatever it is that you need to get onto. All right, and last but not least, I'm going to show you. <laughs> I'm gonna show you how to launch a car because who doesn't want to learn how to launch a car, right? And to do that, it's very, very simple. So we're gonna put the car back in neutral, okay? Yep. And the way you can tell it's in neutral is if you put it into the middle and you shake it like this and hit sidewall to sidewall so you know it's in neutral. And make sure that your foot's on the clutch like this. Put your car into first gear. Now, you're gonna to wanna to go ahead and give it gas like this and get off the clutch slowly, slowly, slowly until you feel the car start to move on its own. And at that point, you're gonna wanna gas it all the way and let go of the clutch, but don't just let go of it like that. You still wanna just go ahead and kind of slowly get off of it like that. And that's pretty much how you drive a stick shift all around. I'll probably make another video like later sometime, like explaining it more in depth, but that's more or less the gist of it. So I hope you enjoyed. And this is my first video that I've made in quite some time, like ever. So, yeah, hope it, hope it was good. Peace out, guys.